case briefs and so much more ls data's got what you're looking for a startling revelation unraveled in a united states district court for the southern district of mississippi in 2009 when the plaintiffs discovered they had been sold a fraud kirk david marsh kirk russell marsh and marsh investment group llp had purchased around 150 residential rental properties in Meridian and Quitman, Mississippi, from Aiden Bubber Wallace for a whopping $4.9 million in 2006. However, ecstasy quickly plunged into regret when the plaintiffs realized they had been allegedly swindled regarding the property's historical income by defendants, Bubber Wallace, his wife Priscilla Missy Wallace, and Richard O'Dom. Fueling a legal firestorm, the plaintiffs then sought justice by accusing the defendants of fraud, negligent misrepresentation, and conspiracy in a rigorous eight-day court trial in early 2009. Not only this, John Howell, the attorney who presided over the turbulent real estate deal, was also charged. The plaintiffs claimed that the attorney was negligent and had breached his fiduciary duty. This legal quicksand even ensnared Richard O'Dom, who was charged with violating real estate broker laws. The climax arrived with the court's ruling, a sigh of relief for some, whereas a grievous blow for others. It found Howell guilty of negligence and breaching his fiduciary duty. He was then ordered to pay damages to the plaintiffs, which included attorney's fees, erroneous certificate charges, and defense expenses. Meanwhile, the counterclaimants, Nell Wallace's estate and Harold Wright, were the unexpected beneficiaries as judgments were awarded against the plaintiffs. However, it was a triumph for the Wallaces and Richard O'Dom, as the allegations hurled against them were dismissed, reaffirming the power of concrete evidence in the court of law. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.